In national news, President Joe Biden vowed tonight that his administration would reunite immigrant families who were separated at the border. KCAU 9's Washington correspondent Alexandra Limon reports on the very latest efforts. The Biden administration announced it's reuniting four families who were separated under the Trump administration's zero tolerance policy. President Biden said we must reunite these families. He directed the creation of a task force of multiple departments and agencies. Secretary of Homeland Security Alejandro Mayorkas said on CBS this morning that the government is working with the ACLU to find some of the remaining families. It's encouraging news. You know, yet again, an example of what a difference a president makes. California Senator Alex Padilla says even after being reunited, the families will likely need more support. Humanitarian agencies say some children were so young when they were taken by the government in 2017 and 2018, they've likely forgotten their parents and native languages. We just pray that uh, both uh, the children and the families as a whole get the support that they need to uh, uh, reunite uh, take care of the emotional uh, well-being. But it will still be a difficult task for the Biden administration to reunite the remaining families. Trump administration officials told lawmakers they didn't track the more than 5,000 children they separated from their families. We have hundreds of families left and we will reunite them all. The Department of Homeland Security says these families can apply to enter and remain in the United States while their long-term status is decided. In Washington, Alexandra Limon, KCAU 9 News.